Sawa na ba kayo sa Tagaytay, Baguio, or La Union? At naghahanap kayo ng bagong pasyalan this holiday season with your family, friends, partner, or for solo travelers out there that is accessible by car or commute, then this vlog is for you. Tara guys, join me as I explore this top tier resort in Pantabangan, Nueva Ecija. A few moments later So, kararating lang namin dito sa May uh, Resort. And before kami mag-check-in, magla-lunch muna kami kasi we're so hungry na, guys. So, yeah, let's eat. Let's eat, guys. Shut up. This is your girl Luisa and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video guys, of course, this is gonna, gonna be another travel vlog and we are here in Nueva Ecija. So yun guys, specifically sa may Pantabangan Nueva Ecija. So if you want to also uh, go here for just a quick trip, uh, sakay lang kayo ng 5-star uh, bus from Pasay. So meron ng terminal doon. So sakay kayo ng papunta ka ba na Tuan uh, City. Yung fare is 270 pesos per pack. So yung travel time, um, yung sa amin kanina, 4 hours 30 minutes. So depende rin siya sa traffic. And every 30 minutes may biyahe naman nun uh, doon papunta ka ba na Tuan uh, City. So may stopover siya. Kanina isang beses na lang. The last time na nagdinggalan kami, parang nakatatlong stopover kami. So depende ata siya sa oras ah. Uh, ng uh, trip nyo. So, yun, uh, from Cabanatuan City, uh, sinundo kami ng um, re uh, representative mismo sa resort kasi nag-offer naman uh, sila na magsundo. So, yun. But if in case wala ng option na ganyan, pwede kayo uh, mag-jeep and mag-tricycle from Cabanatuan City papunta dito mismo sa may resort sa Pantabangan, Nueva Ecija. So, I think yung fare ng jeep is 80 pesos. 
And from Pantabangan Town, uh, sakay na lang kayo ng tricycle papunta mismo dito sa my uh, resort. So, yung fare uh, ranges from 50 to 100 pesos ata sa tricycle. So, they don't have a specific amount kasi wala silang toda. So, you really need to talk to the driver. Yes, nandito kami nag-check-in sa my Lake Farm de la Mar, dito sa my Pantabangan Nueva Ecija. So, later, you'll know kung bakit dito namin pinili. Kasi sobrang ang dami yung activities na magagawa dito. And ang ganda ng resort, guys. As in, na-shock talaga ako nung nakita ko siya. Uh, ang laki din ng property nila. Uh, before I give you uh, the room tour, um, nga pala, yung binook lang namin na room dito, supposedly, kasi dalawa lang naman kami ni Bench, is yung couples, uh, couple na kasitas nila, which is actually, uh, yung rate niya is 5,000 for 2 packs. Pero sa room na yun, pwede naman siya maximum up to 4 packs. Pero you have to add uh, 1,000 pesos per packs na kapag sobra na kayo doon sa two packs lang talaga na dapat uh, sa room. Pero, uh, kanina in-inform nila kami na fully booked na pala yung uh, couple's room nila. So, yon they had to upgrade us. So, may free upgrade kami. And yung binigay nilang nila na room namin, which is yung natitira na lang, is yung... Um, Casitas uh, de Filipina with kitchen. So yung Casitas guys, this is actually a three-story, eight-type house with kitchen, dining room, living room, and uh, may isa pe and loft bedroom. So we are not complaining. Ang ganda din talaga nung uh, Casitas na binigay nila sa amin. And may kitchen pa, which is hindi naman kami magluluto, di ba? So yun, uh, yung season din kasi is around November na. So to December, medyo be, uh, fully booked na rin daw kasi talaga di dito kasi syempre pag mga ganitong months na diba madami na talaga yung namamasyal at hindi and aside from pamamasyal, mostly of them mag-check in din talaga and mag overnight and what's good about this resort guys is they have day tours so if ever ayaw nyo dito mag-overnight gusto nyo lang mamasyal, gusto nyo lang i-try yung uh, attractions na meron sila dito, activities, gusto nyo makita yung view na makikita mo dito sa resort nila, then uh, this is actually the perfect resort na pwede nyo bisitahin dito sa May Nueva Isiha. Lalo na kung uh, medyo pass na kayo sa mga bagay na part or Tagaytay and uh, gusto nyo naman lumabas ng medyo mas abit malayo-layo ng konti sa Manila, no? So yun guys, of course, let's do a room tour na para uh, mapakita ko na rin sa inyo yung itsura sa labas. Alright? So guys, ito yung labas ng uh, room namin which is yung Casita de Filipina. So ayan siya. Sa labas pa lang ang ganda. Actually, may mga katagi siyang Casitas uh, dito. So lima to and may kanya-kanyang pangalan. For example, yung isa dito, kasi Casita de Am Amelia and yung isa Filipina and yung may tatlo uh, pa doon. I think yung salmon, ito yung may with kitchen. Ito ata yung without. I'm just not sure. Tapos, ito sa baba. Ayan, pwede kayong mag-grill dito. And yeah guys, nga pala, diba 3-story itong uh, room namin. So, sa first floor, which is yung dito, dito yung uh, kitchen area. And dito naman yung living room area. And sa taas na, yung, uh, yung may balcony na court. And of course, meron, nandun na doon yung uh, bed area. So, una muna natin, of course, tingnan is yung sa may uh, kitchen area. Let's go! So, this is the first floor guys. So, ito yung kitchen area. Nala. So, perfect talaga siya for big groups or families. So, ayan, may mini ref, uh, may dining table, may lutuan, and utensils na rin. Pwede niyong um, gamitin uh, for free. And, yeah, cabinets here. Yun. Lang siya. So, ayan, may mga cabinets din dito na pwede siguro pag nagyan. And, of course, cups and yung uh, inita ng water na pwede niyong gamitin. And they also have uh, complementary coffee uh, dito. Yun. So as for us, of course, hindi naman namin siya magagamit kasi hindi naman kami magluluto. So dati nag-isa may restaurant na lang din kami uh, kakain. But this is actually perfect if uh, big groups kayo, family. So siyempre may marami, diba? So definitely magdadala talaga kayo ng baon if in case ayaw niyo yung uh, mas mag-assist sa restaurant part. So yun, perfect dito kasi pwede kayo mag-bonding habang nagluluto. So guys, that's it for the kitchen area. Let's go to the uh, living room area naman. Now, this, let's check out the man yung living room. Ayan! Aganda, right? So, let's start here. So, walang siya na nilagyan nila ng uh, design na ganyan. Ang ganda, in fairness, I like it. You know, very aesthetic. Dito pa lang sa part na to, guys. And, ito na yung sa sofa. Ayan, oh, ang ganda. And, of course, may TV sila dito. So, yung TV, guys, is smart TV na yan siya. And, may access na yan siya sa Netflix. If, in case, gusto niyo mag-Netflix and chill, 
here and they have their uh, aesthetic chair then oh yan so perfect to if pag umaga gusto niyo dito uh, mag picture picture yon mag chill lang talaga and may pa plants sila i love it yan ang laki ng area guys just may pahalaman ulit siya dito and on the side i have a mirror that's me hi <laughs> So, yun. Ito yung CR, guys. And, yeah, meron ding ditong uh, sink area. So, pwede kayo maghugas. And, of course, yung room nyo, it comes with complimentary uh, bottled water. So, apat yan. So, ayan. Nandiyan na yung gamit. Kasi ako na rin siya nilagay. Here's the CR. Ayan siya. It's very clean, guys. Yan. Mirror siya. May sabitan dito. So, ayan. They have complimentary uh, toiletries din pala. So, ayan. Perfect. Maybe day, di ba? And the shower area, nila very spacious, and they have a hot and cold shower. So yeah, very perfect, sure guys. Because it's so warm, the wag, ayan mo. So that's it for the living room. Pwede naman tayo sa taas for the bedroom. Let's go. Tala. And guys, una una yung makikita dito, of course, may aircon. May extra sila na electric fan. If it is, kung ano pa yung aircon sa inyo, and the plan for there, sabitan. And guys, ito na yung inyong bedroom sa taas. So, ayan siya. Ang laki. So, definitely good for 6 packs kasi talaga ah, yung room na to. For, I think, 6 to 8 packs pa ito dito. So, ayan o. Oh. Nandito yung toiletries nyo na complimentary na rin. And on the side is mga lagayan na rin ang gamit nyo. And ang comfy ng bed! And guys, here's the best part of this room for me, ha? is definitely yung veranda nila. Ayan. So, meron kayong pwede pagsabitan dito if in case madami kayong basang damit from swimming. And ito na yung veranda nyo. Sarap dito yung mag-chill. Coffee. Ayan. Muni-muni. And guys, ito lang naman yung view mo dito. Ayan. Oh my God. Ang ganda. Okay guys, yan yung Pantabangan Lake. So, from here, may view na kayo ng Pantabangan Lake. I mean, look at that. Wow, so nice. Thanks for the bag, guys. Kata, ganda. So yeah guys, that's it for our room tour. I hope na gustuhan nyo to. So, if big groups kayo or family, I suggest na ito na lang yung kunin yung room instead of yung pang uh, dalawahan lang uh, na rooms talaga. Kasi super spacious ng uh, kasita na, kasitas na to guys. As mag-enjoy kayo talaga dito. And yeah, may free parking access kayo guys. If ever may car kayong uh, dala papunta dito sa may uh, resort nila. And you'll also get day tour area access. So, yun guys, maliban pala sa uh, mag-check-in kayo. If if in case gusto niya lang mag-day tour, mayroon silang day tour uh, rate dito, which is 100 pesos siya uh, for adult and I think 50 pesos siya for, for children. Kaya, uh, mas may enjoy niyo rin uh, talaga dito. And you'll also have access sa entertainment room nila na you can access it for 2 hours. So, yung check-in and check-out time nila is same pa rin naman, 2 p.m. for the check-in and check-out is 2 p.m. So yeah, that's it for the room tour and everything about this room. Any additional, uh, ilalagay ko na lang uh, sa screen. So, see you guys later. Magpapahinga muna kami ng content. Lake Form de la Mar is an agritourism park which is located in one of the oldest towns in Nueva Ecija, Pantabangan. When COVID hit, a window of opportunity opened to agritourism in Pantabangan for its ambient space and lush scenery. This resort was originally intended as a retirement farmhouse but because of its location facing the Pantabangan Lake and the lush forest, they started developing parts of the land to open to visitors and gather a large market by offering data activities like sightseeing, picnic, ATV rides, and overnight accommodations through camping and glamping. Hi guys, update. So it's already 6.30 in the evening na. So, mapag-rest na kami. And of course, mapagpalit na tayo ng outfit. So, lalabas na kami at maglalakad-lakad kami sa labas. So, tingnan namin kung ano yung uh, itsura dito kapag uh, gabi. Let's go. Ganito guys ang itsura ng, uh, sa labas ng pasitas namin. Ayan. Lamig pala dito guys. Lakas ng hangin dito. So, ang sarap maglakad-lakad dito kapag gabi. Yeah. 
And here's their famous 5,000 Roses. It's actually the first one in the north, guys. Grabe, sobrang ganda ng vibe ah, ng resort na to at night. So guys, nandito yung uh, cafe or restaurant area nila. So ayan siya. Nandun yung pool sa court na yun. Tapos ito yung uh, cottages din nila dito na pwede nyo ang tambayan. Ayan. Tapos nandun yung signage nila na I Heart Lake Farm de la Mar. So, ayan. It's so nice here guys. Tsaka meron sila nitong ano, giant star. Ang sabi nila, I think sa November 20 or 22, they're gonna light that up. Uh, magkakaroon sila ng uh, lighting ceremony uh, for that one. Grabe guys, ang pras ko ng hangin dito. As in, if you're gonna try it here, super ma-appreciate nyo talaga rin dito kapag gabi. Kasi syempre pag gumaga, of course, pag pala na pagpatanghali na mainit na siya. Pero sa ngayon, grabe ang pras ko ng hangin guys. Ang sarap lang mag-chill. You know, kahit solo or with your friends or with your family, you're gonna love it here for sure. So, try nyo dito guys. So, don't worry. All details will be included sa description box. And of course, uh, tomorrow, I'll be uh, providing you with more details na din. Kasi, of course, we're gonna shoot this place din ng umaga. Para just makita nyo din siya ano yung, you know, itsura niya talaga dito kapag umaga din. Kasi medyo late na ako. Nakapag-start kanina mag-vlog and syempre, <laughs> Uh, GoPro lang ho yung gamit ko pag uh, vlog so hindi siya ganun uh, kaganda yung performance niya when it comes to night uh, videography you know so yeah after namin mag pro and then we're gonna have our dinner guys so of course I'm gonna take you with us They also have the Belen. And we're back here at the La Cocina de Maricar. So we're gonna have our dinner here. And here's our table. <laughs> so we ordered their classic bolalo for 500 pesos and pork sisig which is worth 395 pesos. So both meals guys are for sharing na. Sister sisig. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we also try their lychee and green apple fruit teas. Both worth 125 pesos. In terms of taste and level of sweetness, must prefer ko yung um, lychee fruit tea. After dinner, you can hang out here at the cafe by the tree. And of course, one thing you're gonna love about this resort is they have acoustic bands, guys. So it's masarap ang chill dito. Guys, yung pool nila kapag gabi. And to get a nice view of their uh, resort, uh, akit lang kayo dito sa may taas ng 5,000 roses para makita nyo yung buong uh, paligid na to. Guys, may playground din dito for kids. And oh, <laughs> ganda ng color. Okay guys, 
Bakit na tayo para matulog? Good night! <laughs>
So, yun, babalik na kami sa may kasita namin kasi we're going to prepare na and mag-check out na rin kami uh, in a bit. So, yeah, see you guys later. So yun guys, ito ang view ng Pantabangan Lake dito sa may veranda sa may reception area ayan, wow, ang ganda and I think guys yung glamping area nila nasa baba pa ng uh, side ng mga kasitas na yan and nandun din yung bonfire pit nila so hindi pa namin siya napuntahan we'll see if kaya siyang abutin sa drone or we'll see kung kaya pa namin siyang puntahan uh, later bago umuwi yan, enjoy the view and ito yung pool Course. And guys, it's already 12:11. So nakapag-check out na kami and pinayagan naman nila kami pumunta dito sa may uh, veranda part para at least makita din namin yung view ng buong uh, lake farm uh, from here and of course yung Pantabangan uh, Lake. Super uh, ganda guys. So mag-chill muna kami dito tapos siguro take videos pa yung mga hindi pa namin na video uh, kahapon and kanina. Then uh, one last time kakain kami doon sa may restaurant nila. Then uh yeah, we and time na, oh my god, super bitin yung isang, uh, yung overnight stay dito. So, kung ako sa inyo guys, if ever may budget kayo, um, mag two nights kayo dito, better if mag start kayo at least, punta kayo dito ng Friday, then uh, Saturday, then check out din kayo ng Sunday, or pwede naman Saturday to Monday if ever uh, kaya naman ng uh, time yung. Madami naman silang options for accommodations if in case masyadong mahal na yung kasitas. They have rooms na good for two or maximum for four. May mga additional lang. So, if in case gusto nyo mag-enquire, punta na lang kayo sa Facebook page nila dito sa Lake Farm de Lamar. Then, they also have their uh, Instagram account. If in case may mga questions kayo na hindi ko possible na masasagot uh, dito sa vlog na taon. Of course, ilalagay ko na lang sa description box. Again, please check it out yung mga information about dito sa Lake Farm de Lamar. Promise, hindi na kayong mahirapan. And yeah, you can also ask me uh, na lang either uh, mag-comment kayo sa video nito or sa Instagram pa ninyo mga DM or at least masagot kayong questions nyo about uh, dito. So, hindi pa naman tayo mag-outro uh, spill. So, later may update pa rin naman na tayo. So, see you later guys! This is our food, guys. Cheesy beef calderetta. Eat. So, bago pala kami umuwi, uh, may share na ako sa inyong info. So, other than the attractions na basically makikita nyo dito sa resort agad-agad nila. So, pwede pala kayo dito mag-ATV. So, yung rent is 900 pesos per hour lang. Pero I think may options sila for 30 minutes lang. I think around 400 to 500 siya. So, you can also rent a buggy. So, 1,000 uh, per hour siya. Good for two packs. Na yun. They also have giant volleyball, water balloon war, and I think may planting uh, ano din sila, activity. So, you, you will pay for the price of the plant. Tapos, if in case gusto nyo mag-rent ng gazebo, so, 500 peso siya for four hours. That's good for 10 to 12 packs na siya. Ang ganda ng mga gazebos nila dito, guys. So, if hindi naman kayo mag-overnight is malaking family kayo na nandito, then make sure to rent one para mas ma-enjoy nyo kapag kakain. Kayo. And I think they also have water sports uh, and that's in partnership with Highland Valley. And yeah, yung coffee by the tree nila, ang ganda din. Especially kapag gabi, lalo na kung, I think pag weekends, meron sila mga pa-acoustic. So, yung kagabi, uh, na nakita nyo sa clip na, na sa clip ng vlog na to, ayun. So, ganun yung uh, sa acoustic uh, nila. They also offer uh, massage services. So, uh, mag-inquire na lang kayo kung magkano yung rate ng uh, massage nila. And it depends kasi sa type of massage na gusto nyo. And usually, per hour lang naman. Nga pala, if bet nyo for, for uh, couples dyan, meron silang mga photoshoot package. So, that's 4,000. Good for 8 packs na yung guys. So, available lang yung um, photoshoot area nila from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. So, make sure na uh, mag-inquire muna kayo para at least malaman nyo lahat ng details for the photoshoot uh, option nila dito or package. And other than that, of course, yung day tour glamping nila, meron sila. That's 1,300 pesos. Good for 10 packs na yon. And yung, yeah, nakita nyo naman yung cafe nila. Sobrang sarap ng food, guys, doon. Make sure to try it. And, yeah, coming soon, magkakaroon sila ata ng kawa bath dito and pottery 
making. So, kung, ma kung gusto nyo ma-check uh, yung mga promos nila per rooms or uh, mag kung, kung ano yung magiging ongoing promos nila until December, make sure to check out their uh, Facebook page and Instagram page for more info. So, yun guys, almost 2.15 na pa uwi na kami. So, yeah, sasabay na lang din kami sa shuttle service nila papuntang um, Cabanatuan City. And from Cabanatuan City, uh, magbabas na lang kami pabalik ng Manila. So, yun guys, very... Uh, Super ang ganda dito talaga mag staycation. Matutuwa kayo. Matutuwa yung family niyo dito kapag dito kayo magstay. So make sure to try here and super fresco ng hangin. Sobrang matutuwa dito kapag dito. kasama yung mga parents niyo. So, and guys, see you later. Hi. So. <laughs> Yay, <Yeah>, joy are. <laughs> Oh, Yaya lang po ako dito. Hala! Joke lang talaga yun. <laughs> thank you, thank you din po. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> we on a go. It's super sad. <laughs> Guys, nandito na kami sa Cabanaduan City. Thank you kay Kuya Arnel sa pag-attend. Future po. vlogger po yan. Future vlogger to guys. Moto vlogs daw. Yan. Thank you Kuya. So, pabalik ng Manila. Punta lang kayo ulit dito guys sa may Cabanaduan Bus Terminal at saka kayo ng bus papuntang Pasay. So, the fare is still 270 pesos each and you'll get comfortable uh, seats naman na. And that's it for this vlog. Thank you so much guys for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please do like, share, and comment to this video. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already. See you guys on the next one. Roar!